man, I'm so relaxed right now. I mean, shoot, some of y'all fanboys probably sitting at home smelling like 10,000 year old zombie bandages or some shit. Forearm hair long in the motherfucker. You know, you could probably brush your hair with your forearm, you know what I'm saying? Bristles and shit. <laughs> Ah, shit. I don't know, baby. Anyway, this console shit crazy, man. Why? Well, then again, it's not even, I guess, just consoles. It's all, anything that plays video games. Why? Why even have a debate? Well, not the debate, but why even let it go as far as it has been going? With you know, presidents and CEOs and stuff having to step in and tell people to chill out. It's, it's crazy. And it's probably a lot of videos about this topic out there, but people won't listen. You know, I mean, they wouldn't listen to begin with because they know what's wrong and what's right. You know what I'm saying? But they going to do what they want to do. You know, the facts are the facts. You can watch almost any video. Everyone says the same. Well, not everybody. Not the, because it is some people out there that may dress the truth up, maybe lie or whatnot about this, that, and the other. Hey, man, for them, I mean, I don't know. I, you can't tell somebody what to do on their YouTube channel. You can put out videos that say stop lying <laughs> and have all the evidence in the world to support that they are lying. But they still gonna put out videos, propaganda or whatever about whatever topic they wanna put out, you know? And it's an audience for it. It's an audience for liars. It's an audience for people who tell the truth. The audience for people who make videos about making fart noises. I mean, it's audience for everything. So I mean, it's, you can't tell them to stop. But the frustration is there, and when you're frustrated about people, you know about people spreading misinformation, you want to tell them stop. Stop spreading lies. Stop spreading misinformation. Especially if you identify as a gamer or as a person of the gaming community. Which if you make videos about video games at one point or another, then you're a part of the community. If you play video games, you're a part of the community whether you participate or not. You're in the community. Stop spreading the lies. Now, it's one thing I guess to say that you may say something and you may not exactly know if it's true or not then i mean just give a disclaimer and say it in your video recording or whatever text comment that's all good and well man everybody make mistakes it is what it is it happens but when you you know you get out get on the mic and you spew boo boo confidently you know then that's that's a problem you know, and then your breath probably smell like assholes and barbecue sauce. You know what I'm saying? That's that's not a good mix, man. That's not good. You know, you probably melting your microphone. Got to buy a new one after every recording. That shit ain't cool because you spreading a bunch of bullshit. And that's all that come out your mouth. You know? But I'm not trying to be like hard or whatever about it because that's not the type of person that I am but it's just you express frustration well anyone would and there's a lot of frustration in the gaming community matter of fact that's you know you can talk about that you know it's frustration out here it's enough frustration about this that and the other in the community man and that might be the leading cause of all this it's frustration out here in these streets Frustration. <laughs> Everybody want 1080p 60 frames per second on the console. And you, you know, you, for the most part, 
it's most of the games are struggling to get it in one way or another. It's it, extremely difficult. It's not many games that I know of. I've seen reviews. Or I mean, that I have seen reviews of. I've read reviews. It's not that many. Unless they are remaster or something else. It's not that many like current gen. You know, next gen, current gen. The same thing now. That do 60 frames 1080p. And there's frustration in that, man. Because 1080p is the standard, and it's a dying standard. The new standard might be starting to become, what is it, 1440p, and then 4K after that. It's kind of like 1440p is just like, it's here, but it's being passed over to go to 4K. And then, on top of that, you know, they got 5K, 8K and stuff coming out. Who knows what the, what the K's and the resolution and all of this shit is gonna end. But you know one thing, the current gen, next gen consoles ain't there. They, <laughs> and that's a lot of frustration. Hey, but it's cool to be frustrated, man. It's cool to be frustrated, but it's also cool to be honest, man. Be honest about your frustration. If you're a fanboy and maybe you have some anger towards the side that you like so you want to project that anger onto the opposite side like you might be a playstation fanboy and might be like yo i hate that i don't have that many games to play you know this this christmas season so i'm gonna take my frustration and anger out on the xbox side or you might be on the xbox i upset about man these games is 900p 720p can't get 60 frames per second and you might decide to take that anger out on the PlayStation side you know where you might just be angry at your own at the side that you want for not having the shit that you want you know what I'm saying but it's all trying to find the root of the problem so we can address it and solve it and let it go move on this that and the other because it's not healthy for the community for the community you know, you go to the comment section on some of the more popular YouTuber videos, man, and it's like, yo, you like you stuck your foot in the bathtub full of acid, you know what I'm saying? That shit probably don't feel good, you know what I'm talking about? Motherfucking, take an acid bath, that's the last bath you gonna take. <laughs> and that's what the comment section feel like. You know, you might go scroll through a comment section and feel like, Shit, you didn't motherfucking contracted cancer or some shit. You gotta go to the motherfucking hospital and shit and get tested for STDs and shit at the comment in the comment section. And that shit ain't cool. It's not. So I mean we can try to find a solution to it all. Let's bring it to a close. And ex ex I mean, outside of like friendly debates or heated arguments, maybe, but not so heated that you gotta swat somebody or you know cause them some kind of bodily harm or say extremely terrible things about them. Twitter comment section or whatever that shit ain't called for. Even if a person is known for lying or whatever, all that negativity ain't called for. Let's just game. Let's debate. And then that's it. You know, at the end of the day, we all on the same side. We all game. Because, you know, look at it. The whole world damn near against gamers. Believe it or not. Every, I mean, politics, they trying to find ways to censor games. And trying to prove studies that games is bad for your health and mental health and shit. It's crazy. And we still sitting here fighting amongst each other. We should be teaming up. You know what I'm saying? We should be doing like fusion techniques from Dragon Ball and shit to, to come together and become one, you know, massively powerful motherfucker to go fight the evils that be in the, in the nation. Like, oh, y'all want to talk bad about gamers? Oh, shit. Fusion in this bitch and then throwing spirit bombs and motherfucking flashbangs and shit. And just let everybody know that, you know, gamers ain't to be messed with. But instead, a lot of that power just goes to bickering and fighting amongst each other. Shit is crazy, son. But anyway, this video long anyway. 
I made my point, man. I hope y'all watch to the end. Subscribe, make some comments, do whatever. Hopefully you did stay for the whole video, cause I said a lot of shit. That shit is crazy. All right, I'm out, man. Peace.